Hi, boys and girls. I think the moms and dads and grandmoms and grandpops are really gonna like this book. We have some pretty funny pictures in here. This is Dragons Love Tacos 2. Some of you might have remembered when we read Dragons Love Tacos, the first one. Well, this is the second one. I just got it from the book fair, so I'm pretty excited to read it. I haven't read it yet. It's written and illustrated by Adam Rubin and Daniel Selmeyer. So let's see what happens in Dragon Loves Dragons Love Tacos 2, the sequel. It's a lot of tacos. Dragons Love Tacos 2, the sequel. Hey kid, why are all your dragon friends crying? They look so sad. I wonder why they're crying. What do you think? No more tacos, world in shock. Emergency supplies depleted. I wonder if everyone bought all the tacos when they bought all the toilet paper at the grocery store. Oh my, we've got to do something about this. Listen to me, dragons. Don't freak out. No wonder they're upset. Dragons love tacos. Remember the time we had an awesome taco party with dragons? There were so many tacos, pant loads of tacos. Big tacos, little tacos, beef tacos, chicken tacos. And because of a totally honest mistake, I'm not blaming anyone here. There were also some spicy tacos. Unfortunately, spicy salsa give dragons the tummy troubles. And when dragons get tummy troubles, well, you know. Does anyone remember what happened when the dragons ate the spicy salsa last time? I'll give you a hint. It involves fire. But now there are no tacos, none, nada, nil. If only we could somehow get, go back in time to our delicious taco pottery before the spicy salsa, of course. We could save a handful of tacos, plant them in the ground and grow taco trees. So we never run out of tacos again. The dragons would be so happy. Well, I know we're not supposed to mess with it, but this does seem like the perfect opportunity to fire up that time machine in the garage. A time machine lets you travel through time, back to the past when you were an itty bitty baby, or forward to the future when you've grown to be an old man, or in our case, back to the taco party full of tacos. What could go wrong? You know what? Let's strap into this gizmo and give it a whirl. Set the dial to taco party. Ready, set, zam. Hey, that's you from before. Weird. Well, there are plenty of tacos here. Let's just grab some and head back before the dragons eat any spicy, uh, uh, crunch, crunch, crunch. Yikes, I sure hope this time machine still works. Got a little fire blasted. Give the dial a little twist. We'll have to go a bit further back, this time before the dragons eat any spicy salsa. Here's the little line where the dragons eat the spicy salsa. They need to turn their arrow a little bit further back. Ready, set, zam. Hmm, we may have gone a bit too far back. Crunch, crunch, 
crunch. Looks like they went back to the cavemen. Oh boy, not again! They really gotta get that time machine turned the right way. This time machine has seen better days. Oh gosh. Now it really looks like it got scorched. Try some machine oil. That might do the trick. Wait a second. That's not machine oil. Machine oil brand salsa. This may complicate our journey through space time. Zork. Oh no. Dragons love diapers? That's not right. Let's try again. Zank. Tacos love dragons? Weird. But closer one more time. Zam. Dragons love tacos. That's it. Any spicy salsa? I don't see any. Dragons, quick, grab some tacos and let's get out of here before it's too late. Crunch, crunch them. We made it. Congratulations. Ugh. Oh. Come on, we just got all those tacos. <gasps> you saved one. Phew. We'll plant a tree and have tacos forever. The dragons will be so happy. After all, dragons love diapers. I mean, tacos. Dragons love tacos. Heck. Everybody loves tacos. Look at all our different friends we have here. That is quite the taco party. The end. Do you think the dragons will have tacos forever now? I hope so. That was quite the adventure.